we did it in three different hotels. The lobby was one hotel, and then they kicked us out. And then the fight, the naked fight in the room, I have to tell you, that was choreographed. And the uh, stunt guy went downstairs after the whole thing was over. He went downstairs and he came back up, knocked on my door and gave me a hat and said, you're an official stunt man now. And uh, they, broke the, they broke the vase on my head, uh, the TV, all of those were stunts. Then the next was the, the elevator scene. And if you look at the elevator scene closely, you'll see that I'm on the left, he's on the right, and there's only one camera guy. So he grabs my hand and puts me back next to him. And there's this guy in the elevator who's like just standing there. It's great. I remember that. Yeah. Comedy, <laughs> but he's really, he's like, he's a spill face. Like open a rock. He's, yeah. And, but there were signs on every floor that if you get into this elevator or if you go to the ballroom. So then the, the fight was done. Now we went to La Jolla to run into a broker's convention, uh, real estate. So we broke into that. I told him, don't run so fast. You're skinny. <laughs> You're chasing me. Don't run so fast. <laughs> I fell on the way going and he fell on top of me and then we got up and we went toward the stage and uh, a guy that I knew that was one of our security he came and he picked up Sasha and said you're under arrest and stuff and they took him but I knew he's one of our guys gotcha now this two house detectives they come they got me on both arms. They take me outside the uh, 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 banquet room. And I, I'm thinking, I hope somebody knows. So I see the cameraman walk by. He didn't acknowledge me, but he knew I was having a problem. And then the director walked by. And so, okay, we'll, we'll have to get, we're going to fix this. So some guy walks up to the two cops. He's dressed with the suit and everything. And he says, okay, uh, La Jolla Police Department, I'll take him. And he grabbed me by the arm and he said, when we get to the bottom of the steps, get into that van. And I went, who are you? Are you the Lone Ranger? He said, yes. They put me in the van and a guy named Ruben drove the van to the train station because we had no idea where to go because Nobody made the, hey, your, your clothes are going to be here or go here to change. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We got the whole scene done, but now I'm naked in a van <laughs> at, the, at the train station. So this, somebody's going to get arrested. Uh, we stayed at the train station for 45 minutes and then they radioed us that it's all clear. So... I was able to go back and get dressed. Uh, about, I don't know, a year, eight months after that, I had a sandwich shop called The Dip, and we made French dip sandwiches in, uh, in Van Nuys. And uh, this kid comes up and he goes, I want a roast beef. And I went, what? He says, I've seen you naked. And I thought, oh, They've showing a screening or somebody, you've seen it. He says, no, my father's a broker. I was there. So I gave him the sandwich and I said, go on, here, you don't have to pay for it. Just go, just go. <laughs>